Hey guys, this is all streamed out. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of uh, NBA 2K24 with our my career. I'm gonna try to stand in the doorway here and see if I can block everybody. Um, if I can, they're giving me way too much power here. Um, it looks like I can block everybody. Uh, but yeah, so this is the my career. Um, this is our uh, fifth episode on the PS5. And I am going to go ahead. I'm going to play a game today. And then uh, the next episode, I think we're going to go and we're going to do the... Um, I think it's the Rise that we discovered. Um, but yeah, we're going to go. We're going to play the game. MP. What up, Reese? Man, didn't even recognize you without that massive hype machine trailing behind you. <laughs> I'm waiting until after the game to fire it up, that's why. Man, how about you wait until next week? And I don't have to feel bad for what's about to happen out here. All right, okay, okay. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see what you got. All right, yes, sir. And here we go. That's a safe against the Pacers. But that'll also make this a serious test of stamina. It'll be hard for them to outrun each other all night long. Let's check out Indiana's starting lineup. Nice. I'll take an assist. And you know we've seen Brown accept more responsibility over time on offense, including taking these quick shots. And so it's the Celtics getting on the board first. Heald kicks to Brown. There we go. We stayed in front of him. All right. Brown making the play. Halliburton with the answer was anxious to throw it right back at him. Holiday, the pass to Porzingis. Here's MP. All right, come on, Porzingis. Bottom in a plate so far here in the first. Porzingis wow. Not my fault. Ball. This game coming on the heels of their win against Chicago. Yeah, I mean, we saw them do a little bit of everything in that game. Showed a lot of versatility. And, you know, everything seemed to just kind of flow naturally for them. Felt like they were in a groove from the opening tip. They get it back. You know, at the end of the day, size does matter, especially on the glass. Here's get in there. Nope. No good on that one. Some solid defense from Brown. Pacers have gone one of three for the mm. of this one so far. That is a foul. A terrific player. What stands out to you? There are a couple of things. His ability to knock down three-point shots as a big guy. But more than that, his primary attribute to me is the fact he's an outstanding rim protector. Excellent timing, runs the floor, and really protects the basket for his team. Now, here is Halliburton. Following the miss by MP, heel kicks to Turner. Just one of four from the floor. Not the start they were looking for here. That one, no good. Porzingis. Nice. Another assist. Let's go. MP just has a knack for doing that on and off the court. Round with it. He picked up 12 points in their last one against Chicago. Halliburton for three. Indiana again missing. Really just struggling here in the first few minutes. Five attempts with only one fall. No good. Yeah, wow. Another foul. Okay. Need to be more careful. And looking back last season, how about 87% from the line? So that's obviously nothing. Okay, so they sat me down. Rightfully so. Celtics trail by five. They've got Jason Tatum. MP out there with White. Then there's Horford. And it's Hauser in at the small four. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. Fires for three. They get it back. Oh, come on. Wow. In a moment, I'll quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Pacers. But finding open space okay. to operate with, with So we're going to try not to foul. Um, I wasn't even trying to foul on any of those three. In the 2016 and 17 drafts, GA Boston ended up with the third pick. No, we just need to do better. And they nailed those picks, getting Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum back to back, setting up their franchise for years. 
Here's who Rick Carlisle start in the second half with. Backcourt pair for him, Halliburton and Brown. Come on. He's out there with Buddy Heel, and it's Turner in at the pivot, manning the middle. Nope, nope, nope. That's what it is. I think I get that rebound, and I don't. So I try to shoot, and it ends up as a reach. Get in there. Thanks, Kevin. The Pacers are a team on the rise, and Tyrese Halliburton says one of the favorite parts okay. of the way we're building the culture here is it's not just showing up for a game. That's it. We watch games, text about games, talk about games when we get to the arena. I just want to be around guys who love basketball wow. and want to be great. Kevin? Isn't that special, David? Hey, thanks for that report. And out of the gates here in this second half, they have not started well. 0 of 3. And here's Tatum. He'll bring it up for the Celtics. It's a one-point game. He'll be off to Brooklyn for a meeting with the Nets after this one. And that one will start off a three-game road trip for the team. Here's MP. The Pacers pull I in. can't hit anything anymore. The the game was not. Boy, they need to pick it up here now. I mean, they're 0 of 4 coming out of the break. Brown outside. Pass to Halliburton. Indiana moving it around. Pocket six. Turner. Wow. Turner's got seven points. Okay. That's their third straight make off an assist. Oh, Greg, there's a lot of impressive things about Tyrese Halliburton, most notably how efficient he is. Yeah, Kevin, those percentages are terrific. But not only that, he's phenomenal at it, making sure he keeps his teammates involved. Just a remarkable young point guard. Outside Tatum. Takes the go, go, go. A three from Tatum. You got to D up Tatum from deep. He's got that guy. Okay. We're going to do everything we can to not foul. minutes off the clock in this final half of play. Passes to Turner. That's tipped and stolen by Tatum. And here they go. Get in there. Thank you. Finally. This is why guys love playing with Holiday. I mean, because of how unselfish he is. Halliburton against Holiday. The kick out to Brown. Halliburton outside. Heel finds Halliburton. Six to shoot. Okay. And that is a foul. We get two shots. Come on. There we go. Assessing a technical free throw. It's necessary or guys will keep jerking their heads and falling down and, and who wants to see that? Looking at who's out there now for the Celtics. Luke Cornett, he's checked in for Przingis and Al Horford subbed in for Jason Okay, we'll back off a little bit. There we go. Top and inside. It's tipped. Round against Matherin. On the wing, MP. Cornet passes Get in to there. MP. Some solid defense from Brown. Pacers trail by three. Has to heal. But Trey. It's hauled in by Brunt. Brown's got six rebounds in the game. Here's MP. Really? Pacers pull it in. Brown's got nine rebounds now tonight. They've been struggling here on Wow. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Good work by Matherin getting rid of the ball when somebody has a better shot. You got to throw it his way. Down against MP. To the inside. Cornet kicks. Well, let's try it again. Here's the screen. 
Inside, there we go. Jacobson's got his third assist on the night. Healed against Holiday. Healed the pass to Toppin. The layup off target. Those are chances almost always. All right, and uh, we're up by three at the end of three. And here we go. And he got it. Then there's Derek White. And it's Hauser in at the three spot. That's the Boston Five. They've given up a lot of three pointers here today. And their defensive rotations have been non existent. Here's Halliburton. All right. No problem. No problem. Whenever that mid range jump shot is available, Halliburton is going to take advantage of it. He's a really good passer, but also an opportunistic scorer. Nice. That'll work for me. Okay. That was all right. Halliburton read what the defense was trying to do and then found his man off the pick. Beautifully done. Horford with a screen on McConnell. Floats it up for Horford. And it's going to be out of bounds. The pace really? No clue where that pass was going. That is a brutal turnover. So both teams making some changes here. Pacers trail by four. McConnell passes to Matherin. Turner with a screen on White. White. Okay. Back to Turner. The rebound by the Celtics. And they haven't been able to turn it into a big lead, but their rebound and advantage is starting to add up. Yeah, still close, but with their tough play on the boards, we're certainly seeing the effort. See what we can do here. MP against McConnell. Oh, and okay. I'll take it. Now that's how you orchestrate the pick and roll. MP with the great feed there to his teammate. Bounce pass from McConnell. Here's Matherin. Tried to bank it in, but he misses. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high impact defense they want to see out of him. Another assist. Holiday's got the lead up to eight now for Boston. They should continue to get the ball inside. I mean, I'd like to be scoring more, but I'll gladly assist. And here we go with uh, 227 to go in the game. Neesmith, he's checked in for Choppin. Heald comes in for Benedict Matherin. And it's Brown in for TJ McConnell. And now the latest from our reporter, David Alder. Well, during the break, I listened in on Rick Carlisle's huddle. They said, let's lock in, keep our focus. We need everyone down the stretch. Now okay. The players looked engaged, so I think the message got across. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. Celtics leading by six. Holiday looking for an opening. Here's MP. And it's oh. by Turner. Man, the defense of Turner is astounding. I mean, he positioned himself well to come up with a lot of blocks. Back to Halliburton. The feed to Turner. Doesn't go that time. Nice D from Porzingis. Get in there. Wow. Turner's got rebound number five here tonight. against Halliday. Turner with a screen on Halliday. Halliburton for three. It's hauled in by Jacobson. You know, the ill-advised threes isn't how you want to close the gap. You've got to have okay. shots on it. Boy, patrolling the paint well, protecting the rim, that's exactly the kind of defensive effort you need against him. Halliburton kicks to Brown. And he's good on the We're up by three. Confident and composed on the three-point shot at a critical juncture. Holiday, the pass to Tatum. 
That was a good shot. All it was was it was just missed time, but it was a good shot. It was open. Okay. Yep, go ahead and foul me. Okay, I'm trying to get the pass and it, they won't pass it to me. Okay, we're up by two. We are up by three. And the final timeout for Indiana. And here we go. Seconds left in the fourth quarter. Well, I tell you, that was double duty right there. He influenced the shot and then got back and cleaned the black. We're up by three. We're up by four. But there was no time really to be selective. And we're up by five. And Holiday doesn't get easily rattled. He has a calm personality that helps him in big moments. Those free throws are the nail in the coffin, guys. Uh, he's found his rhythm from deep, and, and you can see the confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident too. It made me pass. It forced it. I did not want to get rid of that. Okay. Well, we have one. Okay. We win by four. MP, it's Chris Matthews. Got your number from your dad. Hope that's okay. Okay. Uh, new side quest. Uh, I didn't quite see it, but okay. So that is where we are going to end today's episode. I want to thank everybody for watching. My name is Allstream. That hit the like button if you like this type of content. It lets me know that you like this particular type of content and would like to see more. Hit the subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications to be notified every time I post a video. And follow me on Twitter, Discord, and on the second channel. The links are in the description below. Have a wonderful day.